here with Jacody Outdoor Recreation. So, what are we doing today, Bill? Well, I just got done muzzleloader elk hunting, and I don't know if you know this or not, but when you muzzleload, you're not allowed to have any kind of firearm with you. By firearm, I mean any piece of cartridge, anything that's not single chamber. So let's say you have a nice percussion revolver, and you think, well, that's black powder. I should be able to have that. No. The way Arizona regulates it is you have to have a single chamber, single chamber only. So that's the key. So what do you do if you need to do a quick follow-up shot, if you have to do a mercy shot? Well, you got to get your hold, got to get a hold of uh, some speed loaders. And who makes the best ones, or who did make the best ones, was Butler Creek. Butler Creek, I got a package of these. I'm going to bring them in close so you can see them. This is a Butler Creek uh, speed loader. This is what it looks like out of the package. And they come color coded. You get a tan one for 45, you get a green one for 50, a brown for 54, and a black for 58. And what this is basically is you can keep your powder in here and a ball in a patch, and you can speed load your muzzle loader for a quick follow up shot. And to do that successfully, you kind of have to know the 45 degree load. We're going to get into that. But I wanted to share this with you. Butler Creek doesn't make these anymore. Um, they make scope covers now. But when they did make these, these were the best of their work because they allowed you to put a percussion cap in the cap itself right here. Right here on the ends of the, of the cap. So one cap is marked ball, one is plain, so you can never get confused. It comes with a little clipper inside your pocket. They were great. Now CVA makes them now, but they don't have the percussion cap thing because they're made for inlines. As you know, inlines have taken over, inlines have kind of taken over the world right now, muzzle loading as far as hunting goes, but I like to keep it traditional and uh, so that I shoot a side lock and this is what I use. But if you're looking for these, you're going to have to go online and kind of search around on eBay. These are few and far between. These are much sought after because they're the synthetic safe, uh, you know, polymer plastic that's static free for black powder. And if you shoot real black, you know, you, every little bit of safety goes a long way. So stick with me, this ought to get pretty interesting. Well, this is it right here. That's the lightning loader by Butler Creek. You get three in a pack. And this is what it looks like outside the pack. Hopefully that answers and demystifies some of your things. Okay, well let's load one of these up, shall we? So the first thing we can do is find a place where it says ball. And we know we're gonna put our powder in on that end. Just like you're loading the rifle. So it's 54 caliber. My sweet spot is 90 grains. Let's get 90 grains down there. 90 grains of 2F. Okay. We'll fill the tube like that with powder. Same recipe powder patch ball, right? Get a nice grease patch. starter get that set up and the last thing you do with these and you have two areas to do it is to put a percussion cap in here because that's the last thing you do after you load but I like this because you get two of them so if you drop one like I just did you get a second chance And that's what it looks like when it's done. And that's one hunting load right there. It's 90 grains of 2F, powder patch and ball, and two percussion caps. And I'm going to be carrying four of these with me now, so when I load my rifle, that gives me five shots. You can't do it in five shots. Something ain't right. Okay, so what I'm going to try to do is demonstrate the 45-degree load. And it's called a 45-degree load because if you've got a shot into some game, the first thing you do is drop to the ground because you don't want them to know or get startled. Because that first shot, more than likely, with an elk especially, you know, you think, oh, I took a heart and lung. You know, I got this shot right behind the shoulder blade. It's heart and lung. I saw him go down. Elk will get back up. They're strange creatures. So here's a 45 degree uh, load. As you can see, the rifle is at 45 degrees. So what I'm going to get is my speed loader. This is just how you do it in the field, right? So one part's marked ball, one part's marked powder. So the first thing you're going to do dump your powder down the barrel. They not, that may not go as perfect as you want, especially if you're all jilted up from hunting or you're trying to shoot a YouTube video. So get your powder down there. 
seal that part back up. We're going to get our patch and ball here, right? We're going to short start that through. right there 45 degree uh, load is not easy by the way not easy loading your rifle on the ground especially when your hands are greasy from patch loot but we get our ball out one way or the other with our patch this is a little sloppy but shows you how, how it can be let me get that on there Easier if you do the 45 degree load if you're right handed on your other knee. Okay. where it shines with the Butler Creek Get a cap going on there like that <laughs> 54 caliber it's a good size hole Hey, this is Bill here with Jacody Outdoor Recreation. I uh, hope you enjoyed this short little video on speed loading with the, uh, the side lock with the muzzle loader. I did the best I could with it with greasy hands. I'm getting a little older. But a lot of people ask me about that, and I just want to do a video to kind of shore up exactly what they were. And, you know, that's one method of, of hunting uh, to get a quick follow up shot. Like I said, in Arizona, you can't have a uh, pistol on you, even a percussion pistol. So. You're counting on your on your side lock. So it's your only tool when you're out there. And getting a quick follow-up shot or a mercy kill is very important. So those things can really come in handy. Till the next time I see you, this is Bill with Chicote Outdoor Recreation. You stay safe, you stay warm, keep yourself free.